Good afternoon everyone and a very warm welcome to Delamere Manor. Warm, I think, being the operative word this afternoon. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Um, but an especially warm welcome to Tom and Fiona on this their special day. Not forgetting also Monty and Theo, whose arrival caused this event to be postponed a little longer than intended. <laughs> Would you all please take a seat? Today we don't reminisce. Today we focus on the here and now and cherish this moment of bliss. We see the love you have for each other and foresee what the future will bring. With the promises you make today, dear friends, we celebrate your new beginning. But you know of no legal reason why you should not be married to each other. Secondly, I shall ask you to exchange the words by which you accept each other. Right, right. Okay. So, uh, move on to the second of the two declarations required by law. A Lovely Love Story by Edward Moncton. The first dinosaur was trapped inside his ice cage. Although it was cold, he was happy in there. It was, after all, his cage. And along came the lovely other dinosaur. The lovely other dinosaur melted the dinosaur's cage with kind words and loving thoughts. I like this dinosaur, thought the lovely other dinosaur. Although he is fierce, he is also tender and he is funny. He is also quite clever, though I will not tell him this for now. I like this lovely other dinosaur, thought the dinosaur. She is beautiful. And she is different, and she smells so nice. She is also a free spirit, which is quality I much admire in a dinosaur. But he can be so distant and so peculiar at times, <laughs> thought the lovely other dinosaur. He is also overly fond of things. But Not all dinosaurs are so overly fond of things. But our mind skips from here to there so quickly thought the dinosaur. She's also uncommonly keen on shopping. <laughs> all other love, uh, all, are all lovely other dinosaurs so uncommonly keen on shopping? I will forgive his peculiarity and his concern for things, thought the lovely other dinosaur. 
for they are part of what makes him a richly charactered individual. I will forgive us, Kipping Mine, and her fondness for shopping, thought the dinosaur, for she fills our life with beautiful thoughts and wonderful surprises. Besides, I'm not unkeen on shopping either. Now the dinosaur and the lovely other dinosaur are old. Look at them. Together they stand on the hill, telling each other stories and feeling the warmth of the sun on their backs. And that, my friends, is how it is with love. Let us all be dinosaurs and lovely other dinosaurs together. For the sun is warm and the world is a beautiful place.
I've got you too late.